Uh, what is uh, James Webb Space Telescope? James Webb Space Telescope is a telescope uh, which is uh, uh, considered to be the uh, next version for Hubble. Many people say that it's a replacement. It's not replacement. It is actually augmentation. Uh, when Hubble is a space telescope which uh, goes around the Earth at uh, about 570 kilometers in a orbit around the Earth, uh, the uh, Space Web Telescope is going to be placed in a place in space called as L2, Lagrangian point 2. This place is uh, about uh, uh, 1.5 million kilometers away from Earth. Uh, I told you uh, uh, Hubble is about uh, 570 kilometers, right? So it's going to be that far away. Uh, that will be roughly about uh, four times the distance of uh, Moon. Uh, that will be the location where uh, the space telescope will be placed. Uh, if you look at this uh, space telescope, uh, the size uh, is roughly a uh, tennis court size. I mean, particularly the tennis court size is a uh, size of the uh, uh, reflector, which will prevent the uh, sun's rays from uh, hitting the telescope. Okay, and so that it can keep the telescope at uh, uh, really low temperatures. And if you look at the size of the telescope, the telescope itself is about a uh, three floor uh, uh, building, a yeah, size of a uh, three, four building. You know, I mean, a uh, normal size, three, four size building. That's the uh, size of it. Uh, it's, uh, uh, it has a very large uh, mirror for collecting the light. What we should understand is that suppose if there is a drizzle and you have uh, two uh, uh, vessels, one with a small, uh, uh, smaller uh, uh, mouth, okay and uh, the smaller mouth and other with the bigger mouth okay this one will collect more water in a given amount of time suppose if you keep both of them for five minutes outside the water in the bigger bucket will be uh, much larger because the mouth is large right okay so it can collect more amount of rain in the same way when the telescope mirror is larger it can collect more amount of light which means that uh, it can see even dimmer objects Okay, so that's the uh, uh, funda of a telescope. So this one is a big telescope compared to uh, Hubble. Hubble, for example, was uh, 2.4 meters, but whereas this is going to be 6.5 meters. This is 6.5 meters. Okay, so which means that it has a uh, collecting area much, much, much larger. Uh, Hubble has a collecting area of roughly about uh, 4.5 meters square, but whereas it has something like about uh, 25.4 meter squares. I mean, you know, very large telescope. So, uh, which means if the collecting area is more, then one, you can see dim object. Second, you can also see objects which are very far away. Because when an object is very far away, it's going to be dim. Okay, so then it will be visible. That's the uh, uh, use of having a big telescope. Okay, so if you compare the Hubble and uh, Webb, this is a computer generated uh, image, of course. I mean, the image of web is yet to come. Uh, through computers, I mean, you can uh, stimulate that uh, if web was uh, looking at the same area as Hubble, what will be the new objects? How bright, how uh, shining, how uh, even uh, dimmer objects will come to our visibility. That's what uh, we know. As I pointed out, I mean, uh, if your telescope is big, uh, it means that you can uh, see far away. Okay, if you are going to see far away, it means light has taken so much of time to reach you. So, in fact, if you have a big telescope, it's a kind of a time machine. You are seeing the time uh, that was in the past. So, if you are looking at the moon, the moon is roughly about uh, uh, two seconds earlier. If you are looking at sun, the image of sun that we see is about eight minutes older because light takes for eight minutes from sun to earth. So, now with uh, uh, the uh, Hubble uh, deep space, we were able to go something like up to about uh, uh, 480 million years after uh, the uh, Big Bang. But with uh, James Webb, we'll be able to go up to about uh, 200 million years after Big Bang. You know, that kind of a past we can see. That's the uh, James Webb Space Telescope. 